When we think about hazardous workplaces, the office doesn't spring readily to mind. Compared to the multitude of hazards that can be found in some industrial and manufacturing workplaces, an ordinary office seems fairly tame. It's true that the typical office doesn't have the number of obvious life-threatening hazards of some work environments. However, it would be foolish to think that just because you work in an office, you are immune from harm. Hazards to be found in a normal office can be responsible for a variety of workplace illnesses and injuries, some of them potentially serious. In addition to obvious hazards, such as slippery floors and tripping hazards, an office may contain less obvious safety problems, such as poor lighting or bad furniture design. There is also a range of hazards associated with office equipment, and the nature of office work can produce a number of stress-related problems and musculoskeletal injuries. It's important to identify all the hazards that are present in the office so they can be properly evaluated and, when necessary, removed or controlled to reduce risk levels. Falls are a major cause of injuries in the office. An ordinary office can contain many common fall hazards. These include tripping hazards presented by various obstacles. Open desk drawers, cords, wires and cables, loose carpet or flooring material and incorrectly stored objects are all examples of common trip hazards that could cause falls in the office. Slips can be caused by wet or slippery surfaces or by wearing footwear inappropriate to the workplace. As you can see, it's easy for any office to be full of hazards that could cause slips, trips and falls. However, such hazards are among the easiest to eliminate or control. A big part of preventing fall accidents in the office is simply the use of good housekeeping practices. Putting items away in their proper place will reduce the possibility of trips, as will reporting and repair of damaged flooring. If you see objects left lying around, pick them up and never stack boxes or other items in walkways. Electrical cords, wires and computer cables should be secured out of the way of walking feet. Any spills should be cleaned up promptly and warning signs should be put in place anywhere that the floor is wet or slippery. When carrying, never move items that will obscure your vision. You should always wear appropriate shoes in the office, ideally ones with non-slip soles. Finally, falling from height in the office is often a result of using inappropriate items to stand on to reach high shelves, light fittings and so on. To reach high places, you should always use appropriately designed steps or a stepladder. ladder.